Hi, I'm Fred. Hello, and welcome all my fellow juice enjoyers. If you look behind me, you may be able to tell where I am. But in case you don't, I'm here today at the Disc Golf Propulsion Map, and I'm here to show you what makes it such a great game. Let's go. This wonderful room is Rec Room Original, meaning it was made by the amazing people at Rec Room themselves, and it is a spin-off of the real beloved game Disc Golf. This competitive experience can be enjoyed by up to four people at once, but you could also play solo if you ever desire. The detail that makes Disc Golf Propulsion so unique is its addition of obstacles such as fans that carry your disc away, or holographic walls that bring your disc to an absolute halt, as well as obstacles that reset your disc when touched. It is an absolutely splendid game to be at when you want to relax with your friends and take turns throwing your discs into the goal. It is also useful for those of you who might want a quick box. Proportion also holds its own counterpart, which is titled Disc Golf Lake, but I'm not going to get into that game too much because it's basically the same as this game, but without the fun. Platforms to climb, sprawling yet devious rivers, obstacles that give you more points if you hit them, and let us not forget these grand statues in the center of the ponds, which are fed by man-made waterfalls. All of this in one single package. But I'm sure you want to see some actual gameplay instead of me talking about it, so I think we should do that. Alright, so now here I am at Disc Golf Propulsion. I can throw the disc, and it's perfectly smooth. Go up the ladder, throw the disc. Not like that, though. Or like that. I don't know if I have any complaints about propulsion, other than the disc doesn't always go where I want it to. Sure, the obstacles get in the way, but that is exactly what they were added for, to be obstacles. If anyone ever tells me that they don't like disc golf, I would tell them that they are out of their mind. Sure, you might not get the same rush from this as you would from paintball or a quest, but it truly is a fun and relaxing place to be. I'm not joking. While playing, it is possible to get your disc stuck on a roof where you can't reach it, and I would always leave the game because I didn't know that I could recall my disc. I guess that would be my only complaint with the lack of transparency from Rec Room, but also a little bit of my own fault for not thinking to look on my watch to get my disc back. And so now, I must bring the video to an end, and I'm not ashamed that disc golf is my favorite game if not the best game on Rec Room entirely. So may God bless you, and I'm gonna leave. See ya.